Hey everybody, Becky from Wake 99 er here. So I have a brand new package and this is from Fandom of the Month. So again, um, it's been a while since I've had one of these, but this was the first subscription box that I ever got for myself, but now we're back to an envelope. Um, when they first came out, they came in envelopes and they got these really cute little boxes with owls. Um, I'm not sure when she got new distributors, if it changed or um, she can't get the boxes anymore. I'm not quite sure what happened. But um, this is the first one I got a shipping notification the other day. Have no idea what the theme is, but everything will be packaged in here. There's a little Phantom of the Month card, and then the other side has just a little bit of a clue of what this is. And I have no idea just from this clue. Um, normally there's something on there that tells you, gives you an idea of what will be inside here. Uh, the next clue is sometimes the bag. Occasionally, Fandom of the Month does put clues on Instagram, but again, like I said, it's been a while since they've done one of these. Um, so the bag doesn't really help me either. I don't know, is it just kind of like paintings or artwork or flowers or nature? I'm not quite sure. So Fandom of the Month, um, I believe it's $13 a month plus shipping. And it is five pieces of kind of geeky jewelry. So with these clues, I still don't know what the theme is. Um, normally by now, I have at least half an inkling. The last one we got was actually an umbrage bag from Harry Potter. But I've gotten some along the way, hey Ben Ben, um, that have been, you know, Star Wars or Doctor Who. And a bunch of fun little dorky themes. Um, I was actually able to, oh I actually know what this is now looking at the items inside. Um, I was able to take some of this jewelry when I went to the Land of Oz. I had Wizard of Oz jewelry to wear. So, this, the first clue I have, and I absolutely, I've obviously got kitty cat helpers today, but I absolutely kind of um, adore the theme already because the first item in the bag that I was able to see was a little carousel. And this carousel, I believe, is a necklace. We're going to open it up and check it out, and I'll show you a little bit closer. Um, so my guess with the painting and what looks like a carpet bag is we have a Mary Poppins-themed bag. Now, this probably would have been really cute for the Mary Poppins Returns um, when that was out last year. But we have a silver chain, and look at this little carousel. Let's see if we can get it in focus. Ooh. I'm not sure if we can actually get that to focus or not. So it's a little gold carousel. There's little, I'm sure, little crystals at the bottom. Um, because of the price point of this, you know that it's just fashion jewelry. It's nothing real. But it is super cute stuff. But this, if you wore this with a little blue dress, people would know that you're probably bounding as Mary Poppins. We also have a little cuff bracelet. Now we get a bunch of these with Phantom of the Month. Um, this one is super cute, and it's silver, so I'm more likely to wear it, but it actually says supercalifragilisticexpialidocious right on it. So I still can't say that 10 times fast, but it is really cute. Um, I believe they are a little stretchy, so they should be able to just go right on anybody's wrist. There you go. So that is adorable. We have two more items. Normally these packages in the past, um, since they relaunched this year, she had a little bit of a distribution error. Um, when they relaunched, they stopped doing the magnets, which kind of makes me sad. I have a whole display of them in my kitchen from the years of getting these. But we have kite earrings. Those are super cute. I've got to keep this stuff away from the kitten who thinks they're for him. And the last item, it looks like we have a second necklace. Um, I'm not sure if you'd be able to layer these or not if you put them together. But let me see if I can get this open. I have to get rid of all these little bags. So I want to say these are probably too long to layer together with this and the carousel. But we actually do have a silhouette of Mary Poppins. So I'm not sure. Um, this doesn't look like, this looks more like um, one of Bert's chalk drawings than it does like the Royal Dalton Ball, uh, bowl, whatever from the second one. Um, so I'm guessing this is from the original Mary Poppins. Super cute items. Again, it's only $13 a month. Right now, I will put a link if you're interested in getting these for yourself or you know somebody that's just a little dorky that might enjoy these. Um, I'm not sure if they are coming out every month because I haven't received one in a few months or if it's every quarter now. 
Um, like I said, there were some distribution errors and issues that she had with um, companies she was working with, but I'm really happy to see these back again. Um, again, for the price, super cute stuff. I'm not sure that Disney's going to have another Mary Poppins movie, but you never know. Um, but these are really cute to uh, wear to different things. So if you're going to Disney and you like bounding, super cute accessories for super affordable. So again, all the information, I'm sorry, I'm teasing the cat with a chain. All the information will be below. Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell if you want to get our videos. We're doing videos three to four times a week right now. And that's it for today. We will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.